What's up, everybody? It's Swordfish and Azim. Monday night. We're going to play a little DST. We're going to get back into the public donut world server. Donuts. <laughs> Sorry, everybody. I'm feeling a little silly, goofy. I don't know. Feeling a little goofy tonight, uh, but that won't stop us from having some fun. We're going to play a little Don't Starve together. It is late winter. We've got, um, it's a night for Goofy 3. It is a night for Goofy. How are you doing? Uh, I was uh, doing a flyby on, uh, on Twitch before dinner earlier tonight, and I saw that you were... Uh, crafting, uh, but it was truly a flyby. I don't know what you were crafting. I don't know what today's uh, theme was, that is. Um, what's the deal with this guy? Are you fully tamed? No, you... S uh, oh, yeah, you are. Okay, yeah, you're fine. You're fine. Oh, I'm going to get a deer clops. Okay. I think I'm going to get the deer clops because I'm the only one here. Hey, swordfish. It is late winter and I am here in that clops. Today's prompt was technically sun, but you were catching up on older ones. Stitched and memory. Ooh, stitched and memory. Okay. Yep, I hear that clopsy. Oh, I should have brought the... Uh, I should have brought the the um, bee keep, the bee the, blah, 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 the bee queen crown. That would have been very useful. But oh well. Okay, I'll just kill him. Can we do a no hit? We certainly should be able to. The only issue will be shadows potentially getting in the way because I did not bring the Bee Queen crown because I totally forgot about Klops, period. And for I was winter. Oh, and hounds. <laughs> okay, so no hit may be too optimistic. Between, between uh, shadows and uh, hounds about to show up. Oh, yep, there was the hit. I just distracted myself. I, get, I should lead him over to the fire. Argo in. Oh, no. Oh, that sucks. Are you kidding me? Okay, well, actually, Pops can take these guys out really easily. I just, I just have to get them in the right spot when she does her attack. Password? Uh, the password is chess. Did you look at chess.com? I did. I actually played a, a couple games tonight with Q. Or not tonight, but earlier today. Uh, remember, like, some of the games you've caught me, like, I don't know, sometimes when I, like, log out and, like, do it, some of those have been, uh... Have been uh, what? Have been at chess.com. I also have uh, made the question of the day today swordfish specific. So we'll see if anybody does that QOTD prompt at some point tonight. All right. Well, sadly, not collect the no monster meat for me. I will collect the monster meat for you. I will indeed. Um, hmm. I'm holding some weird stuff here. All right, just going to eat that. Ah, so I put on the uh, Discord uh, that, uh, I, you know, we have a book recommendations channel on the Discord, Swordfish, and I put on uh, Ready Player One 
And I said it was a swordfish recommendation. And three says, good choice. She read it not too long ago and really enjoyed it. Yeah, it's one of my favorite books of all time. Top three. Top three. Easy top three. Easy top three. Okay. Top two even. Wow. Hey. How are you? Why am I here? Yeah, why are you here? That's weird. <laughs> oh, I was collecting tumbleweeds. Oh. Or, wait. Uh, okay, so three has a... Uh, oh, no, no, no. I, we came here for the treasure, remember? We came for the treasure. That's right. Three has uh, asked the question of the day. The question of the day, Swordfish, is what should Swordfish be for Halloween? Oh. Of all the books recommended, that's the only one you've read so far? Well, that's... I think that, uh, uh, to me, means... Um, a wealth of uh, of other opportunities to consider. Now, I will not profess that every book I recommend is right for every person at every moment of their life. How could how could they be, frankly? Um, but uh, they all have merit. They all have merit. Uh, I just had a very funny moment. A warrior spider just jumped at me while I was hopping through a wormhole. But since I was running to the wormhole, I jumped into the wormhole, wormhole, and he jumped right past me. Okay. I'm. I believe I'm headed towards exactly that wormhole, and hopefully, won't have to deal with your warrior spider. Oh, it is spring. We really got that clops on the very last day of winter. Because it is now spring. And yeah, this wormhole oh. is this wormhole is not in a great spot. Yes, sir. I'll be back. You're leaving? I forgot to install a mod. You don't know my political leanings. Absolutely remarkable thing is not neutral. Uh, that's okay. I, um, I read from across all points of view. All points of view. That's well said, Swordfish. I, uh, am not always swayed. Uh, I, I think that book should not, what you read should not be affected. Unless you're, like, seriously not affected. Not be affected. What you read should not be affected by politics. You um, have to see it from both sides. I think I agree with you. I think it's a thing that a lot of people they get it in their head that one side's better, so they only read that side. Next thing you know, they don't actually know what's going. On. Indeed. All right, I'm going to leave this wax paper here because I don't actually know how to make. Uh, bundling wrap yet. Uh, I'm going to put this monster meat in the fridge for you. And in fact, I'm going to put a bunch of regular meat in the fridge for you because I can't do anything with it. Moggles. I need stuff for the moggle. Maybe I will take a trip downstairs. Wow, we have quite a lot of wax paper, as it turns out. I really need to work on the merm so that I can kill Bee Queen again. Not mean to do that. <sighs> oh, three wants to know what you want to be for Halloween. Well, I put the quote of the day because he doesn't know. Or not quote of the day, question of the day. Right? Does he Swordfish, you don't actually even have an idea yet, do you? No. He's got nothing. His friends are, you know, after him to figure it out, but he has got hmm. Although, he has been some inventive things in the past. Perhaps you should share share some of your past uh, uh, costume exploits. I think I have both of those. Birdfish, past costumes? No? Uh, what? 
<laughs> You're just not paying attention at all. Well, I'm installing a mod, okay? What mod are you installing? Wouldn't you like to? I mean, yes, that's why I ask. I would like to know. I'll do Hence the asking. Give it up. What is it? Uh, it has to do with my base. Mod that has to do with your base. So, tell us, uh, what are some of the things you've been in Halloween's past? Oh, you would laugh. I have a habit of going for interesting things. Things that are not character. Things that are like everyday items. That you you would almost never see someone in the costumes that I've An example, perhaps, would uh, help clarify? Okay. Uh... Hmm. I went uh, as a giant iPhone one. I had a Smoke giant detector. A gi no, I had a giant cardboard box with apps painted on it. Hey, rhetoric. Rhetoric has a suggestion. Rhetoric thinks you should go as a um, as a sword holding a fish or a fish holding a sword. <laughs> Maybe. Silent, uh, Silent Three thinks you should go as a smoke detector. That's a great idea. I'll give another example. One time I went, and and sometimes I usually have a thing that goes with my costume. Not always. For example, one year I was a um, a voting board where I had the names of four types of ice creams, and everyone I met, I asked them, uh, "What's your favorite kind of ice cream?" And uh, what they say, I put a check down on the board uh, and I made Ozim uh, or Ozymandias but uh, I made a deal with him so that whichever one got the most votes he'd buy me a carton of that ice cream so I won so I got the candy <laughs> and the ice cream I mean part of the humor of that one too which which is not necessarily evident from your recitation is that it was also a presidential election year yeah so, you know, you were going as a, as a, basically as democracy, but, but, you know, as related to ice cream. Yep. Hey, Lemonade. How's it going? Um, let me see. Let me, let me come up with another one. One year I went as a fortune cookie and I gave out fortunes to everyone. Like everyone I, uh, everyone's house I went to. Yeah. What, what are some other ones? Very first year I went, I was like a Starbucks cup. That's right. That's right. You did do that. It was raining. Oh, that was the word. Um, mm, you went as a old style ghost like sheet. Yeah, you know, but I don't. Eyes. I mean, like, I'm, I'm talking about like the, the. You know, smoke detector is not a bad idea because it's, it's interactive. Not. Like if, I mean, if, you, if there was somebody smoking, you just you'd beep at them. Sometimes you'd go off randomly because you had a low battery. I think that this uh, this idea might have some Could legs. work. Uh, we are doing good, Lemonade. We're doing very good, I think. Hmm. We need more chests already. Any right. marble? Uh, I don't personally have any marble, no. I'm going to go get Moggle fuel for myself, and then I'm going to get serious about Merm stuff. Oh, there's a Moose Goose down here. Maybe we should do a Moose Goose. It is spring. I need marble. Three also suggested we change the question of the day to what is Swordfish installing? <laughs> Since you're being so, you know, if you did it, I'd answer. It. I'd have to go over to stream elements. It's not worth it. Oh, well, too bad. I'll, I'll, I'll uh, give you a hint. You have this. Well, if I have it, do I use it? Uh, you've used it before. You don't use it too commonly. I'll give you uh, two guesses. I'm not interested really in guessing. I think you should just tell us. Oh. Okay. 
Well, it's a client mod, obviously, since you're not the host, so I don't think I have to worry about it too much. Hey, Rhetoric, welcome on in. Free says you should wear silly glasses that extend past your face on both sides. Just a bunch of dots all the way across and say it's a face mask masking your password. Oh, any good idea. <laughs> Not actually that bad. Uh, no, it is a good idea. First, I thought you were going to say wear like one of those big glasses that have like the weird faces like you know with the big nose and like the mustache like a groucho Marx kind of thing i had to wear one of those that would class by play. far be the less least complicated costume you've ever well yeah but i hate wearing them i had to wear one when i uh, did a class play it was you had to wear oh nightmare weird pig right by catfish's cave base Fish has cave base? Uh, yeah, he did a little cave base work. But they had a uh, surface base. Both. Both. Here's a pick slash axe. Maybe I should. Wait, well, no, I. I don't have a match. I'm not gonna do it on a beefalo. That is absolute suicide for the beefalo. Absolute suicide for the beefalo. Not gonna make that mistake. Not gonna make have made that mistake before. Not gonna make it again. I brought merms are friendly. As long as the king is alive, and I did just feed him up. I've come to take down the pillars of the developer's graveyard. You know, we should really be building a pig, pig farm. Uh, yeah, exactly. Yeah, no kidding. We have to take down the merm house. Here. It's a double joke based on a 2001 film. Uh, Swordfish definitely has not seen any of those. <laughs> oh, there was a there was a film called Swordfish, right? It had like uh, John Travolta, maybe. I think I've seen that. And Halle Berry. I had a dance. There is no way Swordfish me. has seen it. Oh, I had a dance named after me. The, so the Swordfish. No. I got a, I found a Snurgle. I suppose I shouldn't be, I should wait for it to come it out of the shell. After me. Uh, got nothing. Rop, rop. Here's the thing, they, they named it, not my name, but they, they, they named it in the name of me. This is less interesting than you might think, Swordfish. Or less interesting. Hugh Jackman, that's Hugh Jackman, right, right, right. Right, I have seen that. And it was concerned with like, Cryptography and passwords and hacking and such. Hmm. Entitled sword. Uh, yeah. God, I had a spy movie. Famous. Uh, it was not a great movie. Dang it. <laughs> like, it's not, you know, it's not going to make any best of lists. Yeah. Was it terrible? His real name is Floss? Whose real name is Floss? Hugh Jackman's real name is Floss? Wow. Wait, is that his first name or his last name? Can't be his first name. It could, I mean, anything is possible. Yeah, but it just... What would be better, Hugh Floss or Floss Jackman? Hugh Floss. Hugh Floss would be better. <laughs> I, I don't know. Flo oh. Gotta pay attention. Oh, Flo Floss cool? Jackman has a kind of a ring to it, don't you think? Floss. Floss Jackman at your service. You Floss reporting for duty. You Floss reporting for duty. Yeah, that's pretty good. But I think you could make like if you had the right attitude, you could make you could make something out of Floss Jackman. <laughs> I mean, Floss Jackman sounds like a bit of a a bit of a jerk. Yeah, no. No. That's how he has kidding. a dance named after him. 
Oh, you're saying Swordfish's real name is Floss, and the dance is Flossing. Yes. Uh, now, you figured it out. No. That's we call him Flossy. That's that's canon now, actually. Nope, that is not canon. That is canon. No, <laughs> that's canon. Fine. Swordfish's real name you know is Flossy. What? Fine. We we uh, that means I get to pick a name for you. No, only three picks names. No. Fine, three pick a bad name. How dare you, Swordfish? How dare you? Floss. Hugh Floss. Like, yeah, it's like a spy thing. Let's call you Lego. Because Ozymandias only has two legs. Because they were like, I don't know, destroyed. The rest oh, of his statue was destroyed. This is why kids and shouldn't make up you jokes. And since you rhyme with it. Since, You're so bad at it. And since Lego it has legs in it. That wasn't even... That wasn't Come on, that's even, a great connection. That wasn't even a groan. Uh, you know, no, funny. I feel like that's just, a great. That's just not. That's funny. a great connection. It's canon now. You, I don't think you get to say what's canon. Well, I don't think you do either. But I do. No, you don't. I. Uh, no, I don't think so. I uh, assert the right of uh, age. I assert the right of youth. Youth that does not have rights. Fine, I assert the right of me having a higher IQ. Oh boy, don't be elitist. Actually done. Oh, three says my real name is Teeth Brushies. <laughs> Ozzy's uh, real name is Toothpaste. Uh, or, that's good. Or, I like or that. Or a triplet. I like that. I like that. I like it. I like it a lot. Do you? It's got a little something. It's got a ring. Well, your name is Tooth. Esco, yeah, come on, come join. Doesn't has an it doesn't have an answer. Uh, it is uh, spring. We got the donut world going on. Beef brushies and floss, flosh, 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 floss. I think it's got to be floss, flossy, flossy. Teeth, teeth brushies and flossy. Brushy. That's what, that's what, uh, where's the ancient key? I don't know. I didn't kill Guardian. Where did you guys leave the key? Did you leave it in the chest? Mm. Swordfish and NK killed Guardian a while ago. I you, think we left it in the chest. You guys yet. probably left it in the chest. But NK hasn't logged in since. Okay, still. Uh, I was going to go do some ruins exploration. There is a completed uh, thing right there. Hi, Hugh. Thanks for the uh, chest today. That was fun. <laughs> I got to get back in uh, back in practice. I, I play against you. No? Yeah. Practice against each other? Absolutely. Uh, Hugh won. I, uh, I had a little bit of a handicap because my business partner called me in the middle of the game, so I was trying to play... Because they're, they're timed games. I was trying to play uh, and have a intelligent phone call at the same time. But uh, but no, Hugh played a, a very strong game. And um, we, uh, we... We... If, if I had been a little more on the ball, I could have gotten the draw. Uh, but uh, I ran out of time. Uh, Wicker could totally prove useful. Yeah, we could absolutely use a, a wicker. Uh, and Kate was a wicker. Well, and Kate. You consider it a draw? Uh, well, that's very, uh, uh, very uh, noble of you. I'll, I will accept. Uh oh, first you would. What's interesting is because of when I was in the caves and when you were in the caves, I have, um, the guardian on the map, but I don't have anything else. Yeah, early spring. I think they they rushed through it as Wicker and the Moose. They rushed through the ruin they rushed through the ruins to Ancient Guardian. Yep. There there was no clear Yeah, there's this is even remotely clear. But I am mapping the edges. Yeah, yep, yep. 
There were times where I was going, oh, darn it. Why did I do that? So dumb. A lot of bishops. A lot of bishops. Okay, this little zone is mapped. Ah, I see where you are. There's not really much point in me following you because Guardian's already dead. You're just imagining Swordfish as a tube of toothpaste for Halloween. What do you think of that, Swordfish? Tube of toothpaste? I've been a toothbrush. He has been a toothbrush, actually. That that didn't even come up and she came up with the floss. I think it's uh, quite apropos, as it turns out. Hit the nail on the brush. Discovered Hit that the nail on the brush head. That was not a great year. <laughs> not not many fans of that. It it lacked uh it it did Blair. not have the popular appeal. Not have twenty minutes until our cave stopped Oh printing. God, really? <laughs> L. Yeah, I'm not staying down here for three days, two and a half days. Yeah, the question of the day, Hugh, is what should Swordfish be for Halloween? He, he needs to come up with a costume for he and his friends are going trick or treating and he's uh, he hasn't figured out what he's going to be yet. Oh yeah. Turn off the rain. Let's I'm you know what? I'm gonna go back upstairs and I'll kill a moose goose. And then we, we can have a wicker turn off the rain. That's a great idea. I'm coming right now. Oh what are uh three wants to know what your friends are being. Do you know what your friends are being? No. No ideas? No. Nope. Don't know. Do they know and you just don't know because you don't you haven't paid attention or do they not know yet? They don't know yet. Hmm. Sounds like the whole gang is being quite dilatory. Uh, that may be too political. What? Uh, uh, Lemonade said a Donald Trump uh, costume with a sign saying we need to build the wall. Yeah, I think that would be a uh, and. There, there are parts of town that that could get you in trouble. Yeah, there, there's actually a... Although I don't know if we're going to... Down the block, there's a house. Very political. Anyway. Uh, I think we can stick to the politics of ice cream. <laughs> they should all go as Spider-Man and do the pointing thing. That actually would be really funny. It would be funny. Wow, I've been on that beefalo for over 13 minutes. I would not go at it. That, that does not fit my... It would be really funny, though. Well, yeah. You know, the other complicated thing here, of course, is that and we haven't really talked about this issue. Halloween's on like a Monday or a Tuesday or something. I think it's on a Tuesday. Which, you know, it's going to be an abbreviated trick or treat session because you guys all have school the next day. Do you have any really mean teachers who are going to like schedule a test for the next day. That would be that would be something. I don't know. It's a Tuesday. Uh you were saying three that you uh you had it in for uh, Peter Parker specifically. I think you said that you were lukewarm on uh, Miles Morales.
if I'm remembering that correctly. Okay, coming back upstairs, coming back upstairs, and I'm going to kill a moose. I go to kill the moose. Wirt, uh, Wirt has some serious moose goose killing advantages because of her strong grip, but Wirt on a beefalo, it's like, forget about it. Super easy. Anybody on a beefalo, really. Actually, merms do a fantastic job. But we haven't really built up the merms yet. Just have not gotten there. Peter Parker, Peter Parker can be annoying. I get that. I appreciate that. low-key jealousy for all of them. I had a friend in high school who used to say, I resemble that remark. Resemble that remark? Yeah, it's a play on I resent that. I resent that remark. I resemble that remark. Because when you resent something, often it's jealousy. It was clever. I resemble that remark. Uh, he may have stolen it. I'm not a Stooges expert. It's quite possible. Is it from the Three Stooges? I I, I uh, give my uh, high school friend credit for it because he's where I got it from. But he certainly may have stolen it from the Masters. Okay. Infinitely. Uh, huh, there's a King Mask there. That's weird. Bree says you should go as a figure eight and then just lie down and tell people you're infinitely tired. I think, uh, three, you have a, um, you have a wealth of costume ideas. Perhaps you should, uh, market these, you know, go on the forums and give America's youth costume ideas. Something insulting was said. Hey, I resemble that remark. I mean, it does sound like it could be a Stooges thing. It really does. I had not put the two and two together, but I think you're probably right. I'm heading back to base. I'm going to drop off this stuff, and then I'm going to go on some moose killing. There is one really near. Oh, you are you taking care of it? I don't even need to do it. You've already uh, already handled it. Perfect. That would be a good one to take out. Army. I just wanted to take up the nest. Yeah, get over there, moose boy. I don't actually have any idols, but I can make some. I need to switch because I don't have freaking planar punch. How have you? Didn't you build the? Uh... I don't have enough moon. Hey, Gong Show. Yes, you made it to a stream. Uh, uh, wait on time. We've got, uh, oh. at least 45 more minutes to play. Well done. Well done, sir. All right. I'm ready to go when you are. Three, if you compete in the costume contest Gen Con, it has to be in the professional category. Well, you have the skills for it. That, that, the one problem with that wormhole is it is hard to see, frankly. I should kill these guys before I go through it. Ooh. 
we got a lot going on here. It's a good thing beefaloes are tanks. Indestructible, no, but they can take they can take a licking and keep on ticking. It is uh, getting on towards midnight for you three. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Let's go home. I'm just tanking. Oh, you guys are killing... Uh, are you doing moose goose or is moose goose already gone? You're doing goslings. We're doing whiskers. Do you need help? No, he's at 1,000 health. Okay. And I shan't come in your direction, because I do have other things I can do. Uh-oh, oh. Oh, that did not sound good. All right, come over here. We'll, uh, we'll make a telltale heart and revive you. Dice thinks that you should be a, a, a driver and scare everybody on the road. Careful, or hot. All right, let me see what we got. Uh, do we must have some glands somewhere? Up oh, there, they are. Let me make a couple. All right, here you go, man. Back at it. Asko's coming back, Swordfish. Okay, I think I've killed all but one. Pew, 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 pew. Ah, there's one. Uh, I need more silk. Every time I think it's time for me to actually get Adam. stuff done. So much other stuff to do. Thank you for stopping by, Three, and thank you for the costume ideas. Swordfish will give them real consideration, yeah. I think. And hope you have a good, a good sleep. Asco, there is a uh, Deerclops eyeball in one of those chests if you want to make yourself an umbrella. Dooney won't need it. Ah, uh, yes. If you can make a book and turn off the rain, that would be even better. Dongshou, I saw you were streaming today. I don't think you were streaming DST. You were, oh, yeah, yesterday you were in TF2. Was, were you doing that again today? Or am I even making that up? I can't even remember if for sure I saw you today. I've, I lose track of the days sometimes. Today was Sea of Thieves. Right, 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 right. Sea of Thieves. I've never played that. Good. Okay, I gotta go. Gotta go kill some spiders. A lot of fun, but a big learning curve. I expect that. That makes sense. Wow, really no spiders here. Got to go back through that wormhole, I guess. We should try Sea of Thieves Lemonade. You think we'd like it? Got 
once again, whoever skinned this wormhole with the spider, it, uh, very, very smart since it is the one that leads to the spider quarry. Really respect the, uh, respect the game there. A minute for the silk, boys. Come give me your silk. Yeah, the moose would be great right now. I wish, I wish, uh, sort of as you were over here. You just plow through these guys. Gong Show, you were talking about maybe trying Woody. Very powerful, very powerful once you get his skill tree unlocked. Simple game, but slow sometimes. It doesn't sound that simple if it's got a learning curve. Well, I guess everything has a learning curve. Your next character? Nice. Which is really helpful if you if you if you do a character and you put it out there that it's your practice, which will show up and help. Last night, that stream that you showed up right at the end of last night, I decided that I was going to practice Maxwell, who I've really never played, unlike ten Maxwell experts showed up. Was yeah. it a, was it a little overwhelming? Yeah, a little. But ultimately, was it helpful? Yes, very much. I'm, I am, and I'm going to go back in. I mean, when Swordfish is not available, I'm going to keep practicing Maxwell. I do wish. I mean, this is the time where it would just be nice to be Wendy. Because having an Abigail would make this so much faster. Or hell, having my... Actually, having brought merms. But... I'm taking the slow way around. I should stop tanking it. Stop trying to get people to play as Wes Lemonade. You, you're sadistic. I mean, sure, if you want to, if you want to, like, learn the hard way to do everything. Thank you. Uh, most of the long-term players do play all the characters a bit. But, but also, there are some characters that they have played a bit and, and have decided never to play again. Well, that took forever, but ultimately, I think I got the silk that I need. All of that for a sewing kit so that I don't lose my uh, umbrella. What's the reason, Catfish, that you played Maxwell for most of your DST hours? To learn the hard way? Not exactly hard. Gong Show, you're almost hitting your 50. Excellent. Congratulations. You're 50 of what? You're 50. You're, oh. you're 50, 50 followers. I assume. Gong Show said he, he's one away now. I, I'm assuming that means one away from the 50. That first goal. How long has he been gone? Uh, uh, Gong Show is relatively new streamer. Low pool, low health pool teaches you to be yes, uh, yes, or just to get a beef low. Well, there wasn't always the beef low thing, like you know, it wasn't always as easy. 
now they they added the update, which makes it like a thousand times easier. I've heard. That's true. I don't know. I just um, I get I get the argument about West, but I can't I can't be persuaded that I don't know. Maybe when I run out of every other thing to do. So for me, I'm I'm obviously not doing it as a way to learn to play the game. And and I think the other thing is the game's hard. Like like the game is punishing for new players when you play as as Wolfgang. So is playing as as West the best way to learn, or is it the best way to make sure that you don't want to play again? Oh, them who's boss. <laughs> Find the hey, somebody go follow Gong Show so that uh, he doesn't have to show anybody who's boss. Ah, it can't be me. I'm already following Gong Show. Why am I still doing this? I got the silk that I needed. I guess these glands won't hurt, though. Thank you for the follow, Asko. You very much. I hope you are enjoying your time in our server. This is a public server, by the way. Anybody is welcome to join. And we definitely have spots available because I bumped it up to 12. I can promise you that you will uh, be wet because it is spring, but I also can promise you a lot of spider glands, apparently, because I'm farming them. I came here for the silk. I'm leaving with the spider glands. Being wet can mean it can mean a different thing. Uh, you know, different languages also have different ways of expressing certain idioms. I was telling somebody this the other the other week in um, in Russian, which I studied a little bit a long time ago. Uh, you don't say, you know, in English you say I'm hot, I'm cold. Uh, in Russian you say coldness is to me. It, that's that's the literal translation of the the grammar. Um, if you were to say a literal translation of, of I'm cold or I'm hot, you what you would be expressing is I'm frigid or I'm horny. So you got to be careful with stuff like that. Whoop. How can there be any spiders left? Seriously. Uh, Swordfish, I've got all the monster meat you can possibly. Someone said fun turfing the area here. You've probably stumbled on Swordfish's secret base. Yeah, he has. He's engaged in some kind of massive land mining project. <clears throat> oh. Oh, full moon. Yeah. Oh, did you just transform? Would have been nice to have some more. I mean, we literally have the thing here that says full moon. Well, I wasn't looking. Not scared of you. I'm bringing back all the silks. I mean, you know, Lemonade, you say learn, play West to learn how to play the game. I say, tame a beefalo. Like, why do the hard version first? Do the easy version first. Language and culture, yes. Very much linked. Because the other thing is, it, it here's a here's another good example of that. In the U.S., of course, when the standard response to how are you doing is I'm fine, right? I'm fine. Standard response. In uh, Russian, the standard response is Nichevo, which uh, translates 
basically to I'm nothing. And yeah, I shouldn't be. I don't want to take that three tier out. I eliminate that. You you like that. They are nothing. <laughs> oh, don't go back in. Darn it. How much health does this den have left anyway? A hundred. Oh, gotta take it out. Um, remember how at the beginning of the stream you said uh, you had been playing chess? Uh, yeah, I was playing chess earlier today with. I felt left out, so I went on chess.com and challenged them. <laughs> Apparently, Swordfish is on chess.com. Yeah, I was multitasking. Do, do you have a. Uh, were you on as a guest, or do you actually yes. have a chess.com? I don't have a account because I'd need you to, like, give me permission. I think you would. We might um, be able to talk your mom into that. Maybe, but whatever, whatever the case, uh, I just challenged an opponent as a guest and won. Well, good we, we, for played, you. we played three games. I made a blunder in the first game. Uh, he forfeited the second game, and I won the third. Now, Lemonade wants uh, Swordfish versus Azim in chess. Uh, we do that sometimes, but we do... He gets ten minutes, I get two minutes. You mean, like, to make your moves? Yeah, when, you know, yeah. on the clock. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because we've got a little chess clock here at home. Yeah, because you've... You're not inexperienced at chess. I am I'm not inexperienced, but I'm not wonderful. Yeah, I'm not wonderful either. I just happen to be a lot older than you. You will. Am I, you've, my it's point it's is you've all about more. practice. You've played. I, yeah, I do have more practice. All right. Time to go home. Time to go home. Finally. All of that, that whole escapade there had one purpose, which was get silk for sewing kits. Yay. Did you say yay? Yeah. You know, I'm looking at this base and thinking, oh, it's so nice that there aren't rats in regular... Rain has stopped at the caves. Nice. All right. Three full sewing kits and one 80 percenter. feel like uh, we've done some... Wait. Oh, the other one's here. We've done some good work there. Um, da, 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 da. how are you doing, King? You're fine. We got a ton of spider glands now. You know, we have so many rocks. I should make uh, healing salves, actually. All right, I am going to start turfing, swamp turfing. Where did I plant those? By the way, bananas over here. If anybody wants to make banana shakes, great sanity food. Uh, Swordfish does not have a chess.com account. Apparently, he's playing as a guest. Uh, so we'll have to explore whether Eagle. he should have an account. Legal. Banana shakes are amazing all around. 100% uh, agree. Um, 
Swordfish, there is a ton of monster meat. There's like, there's 33 monster meats in here. Okay, I need this rot. And I could have sworn, oh, the monkey tails have not grown. Or maybe somebody's picked them. Probably somebody's picked them, which is fine. Do we have a reed trap in this world, guys? We do, right? Yes, we do. Okay. Have we cleared it? Uh, no, I don't need the reeds immediately. I'll go over to the swamp. I'm just going to finally get around to... You just saw banana shakes for the first time. Did you get your bananas from the ruins, or have you been to the Moon Key Island yet? So much to explore, Gong Show. Yeah, there's a lot. You went to the uh, island? Nice. Yeah, island is... Hard, hard, hard. Well, uh, I just did that, but I did it during winter. So I lowered the difficulty level. Yeah, they take all the stuff. That's that's their deal. If you go during winter, the monkeys that are in the huts will stay in. The unnatural portal will still spawn new monkeys, but only like only one every so often. So it, it does lower the difficulty. That is what I did. Come back for you guys later. All right. No, we have not cleared this reed trap uh, at all. Oh my god. Uh, are there there? Uh, we, you know what? We have hollowed knights on. Somebody could actually make totally normal trees. All right, boys, I need you. I need you. I need you to sacrifice your lives for me. No, not against mosquitoes. That's you've 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 misunderstood. No, not against those mosquitoes either. No mosquitoes. Stop fighting the mosquitoes. I will kill these mosquitoes so that you stop killing them. Come with me. I need you to throw yourselves against this wall. That one. Okay, once you get them in there, I mean they're gonna die, but they will they will slowly take out the tentacles, and I will get the fish. Whoops. Oh, I should totally be wearing the bee queen. What happened to that bee queen crown anyway? Did I give it to somebody? I probably gave it to somebody. See, look at this bounty. You gotta be careful collecting it, though. Basically run through, pick up one thing. I even shouldn't be doing it on the beef flow because picking stuff up is slow on the beef flow. It's a good way to get the beef flow killed, but... But we took out a couple tentacles. And now I get to take the fish back to the king and trade for stuff. But while I'm here, uh, does it totally, it does require one living log and a battle of squing. Yes, you are correct. We must have some living log somewhere, right? Anybody, is that ringing uh, any bells for anybody? Let me check in the swamp base. The moggles? Yeah, the, the, the moggles are OP for sure. Absolutely. 100% OP item. Catfish, your, uh, your farm here is suffering without you. 
please make a magic station. <laughs> yes, sir. Oh, purple gem. We got walking. Uh, okay, we got a bunch of living logs. I'm going to bring back. I'll bring back uh, four living logs. And I'm going to also bring back a couple tusks because what the hay. But I'm going to uh, leave you. What the hay? 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 Hi, diddly IO. Hmm. Hey, hi, diddly I. Oh, you're a bit burned out on work. Totally understandable. I mean, not really, because I never get burned out on work, but I'm trying to be understanding. Oh, I didn't even see the dark sword. Yeah, I got four living logs. I'm going to bring him back. I'm just picking myself some reeds. If Swordfish ever gets the Celestial Portal uh, made, you could uh, character swap. Or you can save your save yourself for the weekend. We got to get you into that uncompromising mode world somehow. I, don't, I still don't know why you were having trouble getting in this weekend, but, uh, you know, I'll make sure the mod whatever is fully updated. The Moggles... Um, the Moggles are such a useful item. Such a useful item. I think they are the the nightwear of choice, except for the fact that refueling them is a pain in the ass. Um, up until you kill Celestial Champion and you get the crown. And then the crown kind of outclasses it because of its other benefits. On the other hand, by the time you get the crown, you can choose to have per permanent full moons anytime you want. Man, you guys are getting a lot of rain downstairs. In the rift. Yeah, go ahead. Did you kill uh did you kill uh a uh, aged fuel weaver? I mean, he had the he could have. He had the shadow heart and he knew where it was. <laughs> did you kill ancient fuel weaver while I've been collecting reeds? Rhetoric, you're a boss. Oh, you're going to, but you want to wait till the rain is off? Good lord, man. You're a force. He's there. He's, he's at the ancient gateway. I should have you join all my worlds. I don't need to do anything. You just take care of all the yep. all the hard oh, stuff. That's good. I like him. Go eliminate. You think I should go help? It take me so long to get down there. No excuse. Yeah, Rhetoric's a very strong, very strong player. Very strong player playing a very strong character, too. Okay, here's uh As Asco, here's the um there's four living logs. And you already have a walking cane, so you don't need these. Uh, I need um, seeds. I do not have any seeds, unfortunately. I do have fish. Uh this'll get some seeds. Oh, Rhetoric's who took you to Monkey Island? Rhetoric, you're uh, all over the place. That's great. Oh, we got the reins up here, too. You got docks and trees near the oasis. Nice. Yeah, this is this is a strong crew. We've we've attracted uh, uh, strong players here somehow. It's it's a boon. I really appreciate it. Hey, don't don't disclude me. And swordfish. No, I appreciate it. Oh, you appreciate it as well. That's what you're saying. Do, were you think I was saying end me? I'm strong. I I thought you were saying I should include you in the strong players, which I do. You're a, you are a strong player. 
Uh, maybe not as strong as rhetoric. No, definitely not. You think I would be killing Fuel Run 113 by myself? I do not think that. Exactly. I think I think you could with help. Most strong people would have to too. Trading my queen. I need to take a free trial version for a dedicated server and try to speed run the game. Why do I need a dedicated server though? Like, why would I need a dedicated server? I could just do that. Or maybe I'm misunderstanding. Oh, is that you do not like this alchemy engine? We could, uh, we can, um, we can skin it. What do you like? You guys are up here skinning alchemy as he's down there killing fuel. <laughs> Here, here's the here's a paintbrush. Feel free to skin anything. Oh, uh, oh, you could. Well, yeah, you could totally put a bookcase there. Do you have a bookcase ready? Ham go ahead and hammer that thing down. Because once you've got a bookcase, we don't need an alchemy engine. I need a golden pitchfork. Oh, you're saying that the value of a dedicated server is that uh, people in other parts of the world would have a better uh, a better connection? Yeah, I get that. I get that. All right, snazzy pitchfork. Uh, Beefalo, you can hang out here for a little while. Oh, he came around. Oh, Ramble the Beefalo came and found me. How sweet. Hey. <laughs> sweet boy. What are you turfing? Uh, I'm going to put down a bunch of swamp turf so that I can make uh, merm houses. Finally get around to building the merm army. You know, if I'm going to do word, I'm just going to showcase all the fun things you can do with merms. Remind me to put down a a um a lightning rod. Because if I put down a bunch of merm houses, because they're expensive, if I put it down and then I get uh just crushed by lightning, I really will be very frustrated with myself. Put down a lightning rod. Thank you, catfish. You're not too used to playing wicker bottom? Ina, welcome to the chat. It's a nice base. Um, it's got some things going for it. We have not, we certainly have not done a lot of work on it. Um, but, you know, when you've got this many people in, everybody contributes a little bit. But there's like mini bases all over the world. All right, let's... Put down some marsh turf. Lunar grimoires. Do we have the, um, have we got the, the iridescent gems yet? Thank you for the follow, Ina. Yes, thank you very much. Which mod are you talking about, Kat? Oh, this one? Uh, this is a uh, geometric, no, this is a uh, action Q reborn or they keep doing new versions of it. This I'm Wait, using there's one that places turf now action Q RB two will place turf. Um, Does it dig dirt? 
Yeah. Yeah, Action QRB2. Uh, I believe there is now an Action QRB3, which I have not bothered upgrading to. Yeah, Action Q. Way back soon. I'll, I'll tell you honestly, Action Q, the whole Action Q sequence is, um, it's just a phenomenal quality of life mod. And, and in particular, for streaming, um, being able to, I mean, it's not just the the turfing, which is, you know, an occasional thing, but, but as another example, uh, well, that's a bad example because there's not enough of them, but, um, well here, okay, here's a good example. I make an ax, hold the ax, and now I can focus on chat. So I can see Gong Show. There is one. You don't know what it's like, though. One what? Yeah, action, action. Yeah. Thank you, Hollowed Knights. <laughs> action Q RB3, I think, is the most recent one. Grab a drink of water. Focus on chat. I, you know, I can take my hand off the mouse. Um, Action QRB2 is, is the one that I'm using, and I have not noticed anything that it doesn't have, but RB3 probably has something that it doesn't. Um, well, guess what I'm getting? What are you getting? You have Action Q. Yeah, but I, I it, mine doesn't do turf. What, which, which one were you using? Uh, I think I was using Action Q2, but before they added the... I, they, they made an update or mm. something. Hmm... Yeah, the bats, the bats in the trees are a little bit of a pain. If we're, if we're being honest, they're a little bit of a pain. Thank you for picking up all the turf, Esco. That's very nice. Much appreciated. Yeah, it's a great mod. And, and even if you're not streaming, just like if you're playing. Uh, yes, the wormhole mod that I use is very good. I think it's a server mod. Um, it's it's by uh, Zoom Zoom. Oh, Bang. they added a uh, reap what you sow that thing in RB three. Uh, so probably some planting stuff. Like oh, ma maybe it does what snap and tills does. Pitchfork edible. Ah, erase paper. <laughs> at the uh, at the cartographer's desk. Mm -hmm. um, Ocean trawler rays and lower. Look for a wormhole marks mod by Zoom Zoom Bang. Catfish. Um, that that one. So there was a a wormhole marks mod from some old timer. I don't think it was Exegy, but somebody like that. Maybe and maybe it was Exegy, who's made a lot of the superpower mods. Um, but it stopped working when play pushed an update of some sort uh, and uh, a zoom zoom bang was on the forums or in the workshop asking Exegy to update the mod. And there was a conversation that like the only, the only workshop conversation that I've ever personally gotten involved in where I said, I don't think he's around anymore, but if you wanted to update it, cause cause zoom zoom bang knew exactly what to do. So, uh, so Zoom Zoom Bang went ahead and created a new version and, of course, gave credit for the original. And it works really well. As you can see, these wormhole marks are persistent. You can set them so they only show up on your map and not on the ground, as how I have it. But you can also set them so you just see them when you're walking around with the colors. Why do you need wormhole mods if all the wormholes have different skins? I never get, I never get around to skinning the wormholes myself. The only reason they're skinned in, in this world is because some other lovely soul did it for me. Yeah. But but it is true that the wormhole skins do what that mod does. So it is not strictly necessary anymore at all. But, you know, as a quality of life thing. You like to map the wormholes out well, there you go. Yeah, that's another good explanation. You get right, the, you get the wormholes in. mapped before you have the uh, 
before you've actually got the clean sweeper. It's, it's, you know, rhetoric, I think it is one of those things where what's the personal difficulty level that you choose to play in. So, and, and I have gone in different directions with that over the months and years. So like right now, um, I have, uh, whatchamacallit, I've got the, um, insight mod turned on, but I don't have it automatically giving me the info. I have it. So I have to ask for it. But, you know, if you go back and look at some of our VODs from, I don't know, as recently as three or four months ago, I just had it persistent on the screen because that's kind of where I felt like I was as a player. I needed the information all the time. So, you know, I could imagine there could be a future version of me that does not use the wormhole marks mod. It's I think it's a server mod too though. So it's it's convenient for everybody playing in these big servers. I'm annoyed. Nobody has to has to think about it. What are you annoyed about? I was uh, so I was getting back into the game. While I did it, I was doing a chess move and I was developing my rooks and I got What I hear you saying is that you were foolishly trying to do two things at once. No, no, no. D multitasking is bullshit. You no, you not. can't do it well. There's no way. You you I think you just proved that you can't. I believe you have, Swordfish. I believe you have. Uh, so, hey, everybody, 10-minute warning uh, because it's a school night and I'm a responsible parent. I mean, before, um, before I knew about the Wormhole Marks mod, I used to mark the wormholes with traps, you know, one trap or backpacks. So it's not like there isn't a way to do it manually. The Wormhole Marks just makes it automatic and less resource heavy is it is it a ease or a cheat for sure but you know it's one that personally i live with and i think is fine for for me uh you could moon lens them too sure no like honestly no judgment about anybody who doesn't want to use them or who wants to use them so they show up on the ground and not just in the mini map oh yeah traps you just have to, you either have to be careful about which side the trap is on or um, how many traps there are or something that lets you tell, okay, this, this one goes with this one. I love how many rocks we have. Very impressive. Eat. All right. I need one regular merm hut over there just in case I ever need to replace the king. And those are pretty easy to get. Two fish, three reeds. No problem. Let's go kill some more merms, shall we? Not sure why I'm making the boards now. You know, I find it a little weird that I don't have any music. I think something about one of the mods has jacked up the, the music on my particular instantiation of the game. I don't have music either. Maybe Don't Starve is not feeling very musical tonight. What are you saying? Who are you saying no to? Bird. No bird. Unhanded. I see. How dare you? Rhetoric, you killed a uh, fuel weaver yet? 
I'm not mocking. I, yes, he has. <laughs> he, he has. He's got a bone mouth. Uh, see, I told you I wasn't mocking. It was a legit question. What? Good for you, man. Uh, what is the Maxwell? What is the Maxwell strategy for for Fuel Weaver? How do you do, how do you use Maxie's particular talents? Probably just cage him and use your uh, guys. I'm I'm wondering if that is what you do. I could absolutely imagine that that is it. All right, come on, boys. I need you to sacrifice yourself. You do it the easiest way possible. What? Like, uh, well, t t t talk us through it. We, I will say, Swordfish and I are not super experienced fuel weaver killers. We have done it a few times, um, but I am always looking to do ah, better. We did the lure plant strike. Ah, uh, you cheesed. Semi cheese. The the multiple lure plants is the big cheese. Yeah, but it's still. No, it's good. It's good. I, I listen. Oh uh, no, I, I have no the cheeses. The cheeses. If 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 the if the devs wanted the cheeses out of the game, they'd be out of the they'd game. They'd take it out. Yep. It's like the wormhole marks. Everybody, every player gets to decide what's their their way they want to play. Noble Merms, your sacrifice will not be in vain. But I need all your fish. I think my opponent might just lose off. Are you still trying to play Don't Starve and Chess at the same time? You may. you went very well. I've switched to doing more Don't Starve. I'm checking it every three minutes. Um. Hmm. Oh, I I have no doubt that you could. Yeah, I'll fuel, fuel weaver legitimately. N none of us have any question about that. That's that is you know my um, the other thing is in my own solo worlds, the policy I've adopted is once you kill him once. Yeah, then... one one no cheese kill and then cheese away. Because what a pain in the ass. Although although fuel weaver is also the kind of boss that actually gets easier the more times you kill. Not easier in terms of ability, but like literally within the world, it gets easier. Get cheesy with it. Get totally get cheesy with it. All right, five minute warning. Make sure in uh, five minutes. Yeah, I think that it is on. Uh, I I would agree that it would be unfair to take that experience away from somebody else. Okay, I'm inventing a mini game that is specifically for Woody's. But uh, in this particular world, you know, Swordfish wanted us to build this world to get it ready for the uh, the new content to drop at the end of the week. So we're just rushing everything. Yeah, someone needs to get on Crab King and Pearl. <laughs> I was going to do that this spring, but then I got distracted by finally getting around to the merms. I mean, the spring still is. Right. Yeah, yeah. You turned on the rifts. Go for the void gear for sure. That'll Have help fun. With, that'll help with Celestial. Okay. So let's build merm hut number one. Oh, wait. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Catfish, you forgot to re-remind me. Uh, we do have some banana bushes here, and there are some in the chest, too. Yeah, got to make a lightning rod. Got to make a lightning rod, or we going to have some trouble. Okay. Uh, da, da, da. And now, merm. Regular merm. Oh. Ah, did I. Oh, reeds. Darn it. Hey, have those reeds grown, by the way? By any chance? Par chance? Reeds, par chance? Oh, perfect. 
I think there are guardian pigs somewhere. Okay, I'm gonna grab those reeds. I won on time. Once again, this playing, uh, trying to play chess and. No, no, no don't, don't worry. I'm done. I but I, I, I won. I'm. Thank you, Esco. All right. We get regular merm, one regular merm, right at the edge here, just in case we need to replace the king at some point, which is not, like, impossible. In fact, I would say it's pretty likely. But then the rest of them, I want warriors, which are super resource heavy, but also so worth it. Okay, remember, uh, we're about to log out. Everybody get yourself to a safe place. Get yourself to a safe place and log when you can. I'm going to try to make a couple of these so that I know how, and then I will be logging out too. Oh, and there's the alarm, right on time. I am just collecting. I assume you are in a safe space so that when I log out for you, you will be fine. 36 bananas, holy moly. Going crazy. Did you get them? Are those from downstairs or or uh, or did you go back to the moon key? Or, or, or are you up here? Asko, thank you for joining us. Uh, it's great to see you. Thank we you very um, much. we will definitely not be playing tomorrow night. We have a little bit of family business we have to take care of. Um, and then Wednesday, I'm so ominous. It's not ominous. It's just it, anyway. We've got an we've got an appointment. Um, and then Wednesday we usually play with uh, Elfie Bean on her relaxed world. But we will be back probably on Thursday with this world. And uh, happy to see anybody who wants to come join us. Okay, so that's one. Let's just make one more. Now, these guys, if you are not familiar with the, the, the glory of Merms, these guys are badass. They only come out when there is a Merm King, but they have 660 health and they hit like a crook. They can kill Bee Queen faster than... Yeah, you get you get 15 of those and Bee Queen has no chance. It's, it's awesome. It is truly, truly wonderful. 73 bananas. What? <laughs> Where are all these bananas coming from, man? Ah, you've gone crazy. All right. We're going out with the robot tonight. Oh, the, oh, it was, uh, it was wicker bottom. Wicker bottom was growing bananas. Nice. Nice. That's a wave goodbye from rhetoric. Thank you for joining us. Rhetoric. That bone helm looks good on you. And I know makes you quite powerful. It, but he's, Two characters. We have both characters. I wish there was a way to kill the stagehand. Hey, does anybody know? Can you box if you cage the the stagehand? If you box it up in like walls? Actually, my friend had that question. Stuck? I think my friend asked that question. Uh, near the game. All right, it's just me and Rhetoric, so I think it's time for us to go. Yeah, well, I love. Woo! That was a good session, a good short one, but we we got a lot done. And when I say we, I mean rhetoric, uh, yeah. because rhetoric went and killed Fuel Weaver. But um, I got some Merm stuff built finally. Dong Show, I'm glad that you uh, enjoyed it. I know that you will probably not make it your way to work for a while or Maxwell, but those are powerful characters too. But Woody is a lot of fun. Uh, Woody is a lot of fun. Hey, everybody, if you have not uh, followed Gong Show, uh, go give him a follow and give him good advice. 
Uh, and uh, thank you so much for joining us. We will be back Thursday, I think. Right. What do you think, Swordfish? Thursday? Yeah. We'll see. Thursday. All right. Bye, all. Bye, chat. <laughs>